just when you think you've seen them all, you haven't. <laughs> Look at this. The main entrance would have been on the other side. Look at this pool. As I always say, all the information. Well, they have a jacuzzi. All the accurate information will be down below. This almost has like a little villa style to it. The pool almost looks like ruins. Look at this pool. Wow. This is the little gazebo area. They probably would have been covered and they would have had some lights on it. And it looks like they have like another little, I don't know, another pool over here. And I don't know if it's a jacuzzi. This is a jacuzzi over here too. That one's a kiddie pool maybe. Do you see these floats? Are these what these are? No, Big, huge like, floaties? They're like lights and stuff. Wow, they're really cool though. I love them. Look at that. That's so cool. I thought they were big, huge floaties that went in the pool. Ooh, look at this palm tree. That is so cool. Look at this. This is what I'm talking about. I thought they were all floaties. Ice machine and soda. So this is just walking by. This is like across from the pool. This is one of the rooms. There's really not too much to see in this room. It looks like there's like a microwave or something over there. This is room 604. Huh. So there's the decor of the furniture. It's your white lacquer gold trimmed furniture. Hello, is this an, another pool? Yeah, it's an indoor pool and looks like there's a jacuzzi across the way. And steam rooms. Jacuzzi timer. Wow, check that out. It smells pretty moldy in here. Here's the sauna. I mean, I imagine why wouldn't it smell moldy in here? This is like pretty much a damp area. I'm gonna exit, exit this way. The European spa and salon is upstairs. Let's go to the spa. They still have the tannin beds intact here. Obviously, they're so large, they leave these things in here. They got the massage table in there. All right, let's see what kind of table this is. I can't tell from the logo, but look at this tannin bed. Whoa, really cool. Danger. It's a massage table right here. Okay, I could use a massage right here. Look at that. You put your head right in there and the person would do their magic. Oh, yeah. Let's see what else this place has. This is really cool. It's fairly untouched. There's not really any graffiti to it at all. There's some paperwork in here. Really, really cool. Let's see what we can find. Let's see. This is July, actually, of 2005. Right there. See that? It looks like there's some staff. They're running some numbers. All right. So 2005. Whoa. The 
this is a nail salon because there's where you would get your pedicure. You get your hair done right in here. You'd get these uh, chairs. You'd lean back. They'd wash your hair. This looks like a good spot actually to leave one of my rocks. I actually make painted rocks and I'm gonna leave it in the hair salon. Look, I made a pickle. You're gonna end up staying here, buddy. But there you go. Let's see, where can we leave this? I think we're gonna leave that right, right there. What do you think, guys? Leave the pepper right there. This is basically one of those untouched places. Not many people have been here. I mean, literally there's no graffiti. I haven't really seen any, maybe a little bit on the outside that may be from some locals, but, and I think it's just cause it's like so far out. And uh, that may be the reason why, as you can see, look at, this almost looks like you could make an appointment, walk on in and get your hair did. There's a view just uh, out of the first floor. As you can see. Look at this. Looks like the, uh -huh. uh, what is that thing that, like that plant that, that uh, eats oh, you the there? Plant? Oh, oh, uh, a little yeah. shop of horrors type of thing. Yeah. That's what this reminds me of. What the wow, hell is wow. that? This is, kind of weird, this is crazy. Yeah, Yet man. visually awesome. Wide open. <laughs> this is really cool. The only thing I can equate this to is like being in like a magic fairy tale. It's like all these like oversized props, basically. I mean, look at this. There's a field of like these insane flowers. Wow. It's like tall. It's as tall as me. Magic mushrooms. Wow, look at that. This is crazy, I love it. This is like being in some crazy magic land. Like, what is this? What did they use these props for? Hey, right, let's see what's around the corner over, what the? It's like fake fire flames behind me. And there's a big old bus. What are these buses for? They're abandoned. So this is like the back of the resort. And they have like these, they almost look like tour buses. And yep, you guessed it. These are abandoned as well. Let's see if we can actually get aboard one of these. Oh my god. Is it like a tour bus or like... <gasps> wow, so yeah, this is abandoned as well. Wow, look at this. the TV screen so you could either uh I guess watch a show that's probably what it be would be or to see maybe when your stop your next stop yeah these are definitely parade floats I would guess yeah, they probably stored them here. Maybe they were stored here and now they're just abandoned. But it is cool to see. It's not, not something, it's not something you see every day. Life-size mushrooms out in the grass. Look at this. Meeting rooms to the right. Big magic mushrooms to the left. This is here, and the lobby, this way, past the mushrooms. This is crazy, like it's mushrooms. Yeah, I feel like I'm in like in, in some psych 
psycho like Alice in Wonderland thing. What is happening here? <laughs> it's a gigantic mushroom. This is a gigantic mushroom. This is the most awesome ever. It, it, it's kind of wild, right? You got to move this mushroom to get by. Wow. <laughs> It's, it's a freaking mushroom. In the way. Like seriously. Like where, where do you see this type of stuff? Really? Ooh, look at this place. So this is the main lobby, obviously. This is where you would check into this crazy place. I mean, there's a lot of stonework. It has a very castle-like feel to this place. A very palace-like feel to it. Like, this is the fireplace. Huh. It looks like this is the theater, and here is C and D seating. Look at these doors, these big, huge red doors. I mean, you know you're coming into something. Oh, my God. So this is obviously the theater. Huge. Look at the cash registers still here. Actually, the last sale says $15.65. As you can see, the stonework on the floor, it's very like 70s. Very, uh, that's when they built it. The exact year will be down below if you want that information. Other than that, this is a pretty cool score. It's pretty much left untouched, except for the elements. So this is the stage. It's home to every single mattress in the, in the place. Oh my God. And yeah, it looks like literally every single mattress from this place is right here. This is crazy. What is this machine right here? This is awesome. It's like some control board. Oh, it's a mixer. It's an old PVXR 1200 mixer. Look at that thing. That is sick. Probably for DJing? Yeah, yeah. Wow, look at this, guys. <laughs> I just stepped outside and, uh, Look at the bird. Okay, this just freaks me out. This just looks like a bunch of pods, but it's like teapots and stuff. What? Oh my God, what is that? What is that? Oh my God. There's an anteater in here. So I guess we'll show you what a couple of these rooms look like. Uh, they basically all look the same. So let's see if we can get a feel for what the guests, what the, there's more of them, the look at this. This is, the, there's more of those uh, floats. Looks like a seed pod right there. All right, so I'm going upstairs to check out a room. And this is what the room would look like. We'll just say 624. This one's a double room. Actually, the rooms kind of look um, intact. Right. Yeah. yeah. Look at this one. It's actually still like ready for coffee. Oh my God. It's They're left untouched. I mean, yeah. They're left untouched. The coffee machine is still here. Oh, this this chair is still here. This is nuts. This, is this one looks like a suite. Yeah, this one's a suite. This it's one's an actual big room. Like, look, there's been a couple people here, but that's it. Welcome to the, okay, blah, blah, blah. That's this it. one's a double room. But look at this, the coffee service Absolutely. is there. Guys. Look at this lamp. Oh my God. It looks like it's like falling apart. It's all like hairy. So that was a pretty big suite. Yeah. Now my battery's dead, but wow, I'm just like blown away. Like all the doors are open. 
I mean, it's been abandoned for years. I'm, I'm really surprised it's left untouched like this. Wow. But so basically you get an idea of what the rooms look like. They're left untouched and this is the view from the second floor balcony. And wow. So there's the view. That's only one section. There's like a whole nother building on the other side. Hopefully we'll be able to show you as much as we can. I mean, all of it is the goal, but I'm not sure if that'll happen. This place is kind of huge, surprisingly. It's been uh, known as a couple of names. Wow, these winds are picking up. Yeah, definitely untouched. I mean, look at that. There's like a whole nother section right up there. Look at these lights. So, I don't know how much of this place we'll show you. We'll see what we can see. Actually, we're going to go around to the front. Maybe show you the other side. That would be the main entrance when you come in, that castle-like structure right there. Right there is where you would drive through. That's where you would drive through just to get to this. I mean, that's just this. There's so much. Wow, there's just so much here. And look at this. There's a whole area what I'm going to show you in this pan is abandoned all these buildings you already saw where we were crazy right Look at this. This is just a brief pan of some of the buildings behind the second building. I'm not sure if these were apartments or if these were offices. Look at this A-frame right here. These were um, apartments. I'm guessing that's what these were. Apartments, condos. Some furniture. Wow. Another bathroom over here. So this is the main lobby then. This is it. Guys, I want to get Marlo. So walk through this window right there. It's <laughs> broken. <laughs> and then the door is open. This is incredible. It's almost like a ballroom look. So this is obviously where you would check in. Look how elaborate this is. There's even some skeletons in the corner. Vacation ownership office. What? Look at these props. What the hell? This one is the, so this, the room keys. 
The room key's still there? Yeah. Oh my God, yeah, definitely all these. Look at the size of these keys. That's incredible. This is insane. There's, there's things everywhere. There's... Oh my God. Wow. Look at the woodwork. Look at this chandelier. I mean, I that's pretty, it looks like a torture device. Look at these spikes. It's crazy in here. Like... It's a big, long bar. Look at this bar. I don't know if you can see that, guys, but for some reason the lights are on on the property, but there's none in the buildings. So obviously they keep the grounds lit up. I want to thank them for that so I can find it back to the car. Hope you enjoyed. See you on the next one.